Well, it's not like water skiing, and you can't really call it wakeboarding <laughs> or surfing. There is something totally new out this uh, summer on the lake, and you've likely never seen it before. Fiona joins us to show us how to fly board. Fiona, what is that? I know, right? Look at that. That's what you see behind me. I mean, Whoa. how awesome does oh. that look? Would you guys, would you guys want to do that or try it? Uh, <laughs> yes, that. Look, if you're right, if you're know. over water, yeah, if you if you fall off, you just you just uh, go for yeah. a swim. It's pretty cool looking, though. Are you gonna do it? Yes, yes, you do hit the water, but remember, you're gonna hit it kind of fast. All right. <laughs> I'm gonna just tell you that if you're if you're thirsty when you come out for your lesson, don't worry because I drank half of Lake Grey <laughs> Fine because I tried this. Roll it. Flyboarding looks so cool, looks so much fun, looks so superhero. So what do I need to know to get started? Uh, all right, basically, here's how, here's how the rundown is. First couple of rules. One is don't lean backwards. When you're up there... Oh, so not like lean, the dance floor. No lean back. back. No. no lean lean back, back the place falling. Okay. You don't want that. All right. Um, the other thing is if you get too close to the jet ski while you're up, whether it's 30 feet or 5 feet, I will kill the power, you will fall into the water. Okay. Uh, that's basically for your safety and my own. We don't want to be landing on this. Um, doesn't really happen that often. Okay. So you should be fine. Okay. Uh, those, are, those are two of our most important rules. Um, everything else is really technique. Jeff Bordeaux is an instructor with Flyboard North Texas. It's a jet ski powered lift device boosted by 140 horsepower that will get you as high as 30 feet in the air. So are there hand signals or there like what? what yeah, you're, 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 yeah well, your generic hand signals when you're out there is, uh, uh -huh. like I said, once you flip over on your stomach, we have you shout out ready when you're ready to go up because okay. I can still hear you. Okay. At that point, you might have saw Joey doing it earlier. You use this if you uh -huh. want to go down, and I can do that with your throttle. You can control your elevation yourself. By just leaning forward, you can go down. By standing straight, you go up. You can control that, but if you're not quite there yet, uh -huh. all you got to do is like that, and I'll just ease the throttle down a little. I see. Okay. 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 This, uh, whenever you whenever you crash, whenever you come up, give us a thumbs up. That way we know you're okay. okay. Like I said, I'll normally ask out, shout out if you're okay. Probably going to use that a lot. <laughs> but we definitely, we definitely want to be seeing that. Okay. Uh, I don't think you're going to have any trouble at all. So if you're ready, we're going to go and get your sandals off and get you strapped in. All right. Okay. I was ready to make a splash and release my inner superhero. Okay, so I made several splashes and just felt uh, super bad at this. But after 30 minutes with Jeff's coaching, I finally found my wings. I felt like the superhero I really am, and so can you. At least until you get back to shore. All right, watch this. Ready? Here we go. You'll find a link to Flyboard North Texas on our website. Just click on links. And you know what? If you like them on Facebook, you'll get a chance to win a free ride. So there's your tip. Reporting live at Lake Grapevine and not dripping wet this time. I'm Fiona Gorsiza for a good day. Wow. I wonder what that feels like. It's like walking on water. Yes. Wow, that's it, cool. it's, it's not as easy as he's making it look. No, it doesn't look <laughs> easy. <laughs> not at all, but it looks very, very cool. Wow. Cool. All right. Thanks so much.